Congress came after your fellow Democratic Congresswoman Ilan Omar suggested that support for Israel in Congress is, quote, all about the Benjamins and criticized lawmakers just this past week for supporting Israel as potentially having, quote, allegiance to a foreign country. What do you think about these statements? And do you think this is anti-Semitic? Uh, well, let's look at the bigger issue here. The bigger issue is uh, there's a couple, actually, of, of making sure that as members of Congress and as people in this country, we can have open dialogue about our foreign policy. Um, you know, as, as our uh, criticism levied about uh, dual loyalty, again, as I mentioned in the last question, I've been on the, on the receiving end of those types of attacks. So I can understand um, how offensive they can be. Where just because I am a Hindu, people assume that therefore I must be loyal to some other interest or but, some other place. But what, but what about these specific statements? You're talking broadly. These specific statements, were they anti-Semitic? Uh, there are people who have expressed their offense at these statements. I think that what Congresswoman Omar was trying to get at was a deeper issue related to our foreign policy. And I think there's an important discussion that we have to be able to have openly, even though we may end up disagreeing at the end of it, that we've got to be able to have that openness to have the conversation. But you're not willing to go as far what as I'm saying it's anti-Semitic. What I'm saying is what she was trying to bring up was, so, I, was something that was, was a deeper issue. Okay. And I don't believe that, she, that her intent was to, to cause any offense to anyone. Okay, let's